Very good question. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you, Salih, and make you have the traits of your name, which is a righteous person. Salih means righteous, so may Allah make you righteous. In the hadith, which is collected by Imam Muslim, and Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, A waladin salihin yad'u lah. That one of the three things which definitely help the deceased after his death, the believer, is having a righteous child, salih. Not just by the name, but righteous through their actions. To make dua for them. The best and the greatest and the most powerful mean of benefiting the dead is praying for them. Not to forget to pray for them in every prayer. I know some people, they pray for their parents in every sajda, in every prostration they make, because there is no dua in ruku'a, but dua is prescribed and encouraged to make dua while prostrating yourself. وَأَمَّا السُّجُودِ فَأَكْثِرُوا فِيهِ مِنَ الدُّعَاءِ فَقَمِنَ أَنْ يُسْتَجَابَ لِأَحَدِكُمْ or فَقَمِنُوا أَنْ يُسْتَجَابَ لِأَحَدِكُمْ either way. It is most likely your du'a will be accepted insha'Allah when you make du'a in sujood. Give in a charity and uh, give the reward of the sadaqah to your father. If he did not perform umrah or hajj, he, you can do that after of course you perform it on behalf of yourself first, then uh, give the reward for them. Um, and uh, besides umrah and the hajj, the issue of reciting the Qur'an is disputed between the, Quran, the scholars whether it is permissible to grant the reward of reciting the Qur'an to the dead person or not. Some approve it, some disapprove it. And to come out of this uh, confusion or this dispute, simply recite as much Qur'an as you want for yourself. Then make dua by the end. Pray for yourself in the regular salah, in the night prayer or in tahajjud. Then afterward, include your parents or your father in the dua. The Prophet ﷺ, or uh, the, the, the Quran says, and it teaches us a beautiful dua. رَبِّ اغْفِرْ لِي وَلِوَالِدَيَّ وَلِلْمُؤْمِنِينَ يَوْمَ قُومُ الْحِسَابِ This is a beautiful dua. To say, my Lord, forgive me my sins and forgive the sins of my parents and all the believing men and women on the day of reckoning. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala pardon us our sins 